ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Name Your Price. It's good to be back. It's good to be back in our home studio in Pocatello, Idaho, after a really great. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! The lights almost went out, Will. Whoa. Did you pay the bill this month? Oh man, I always forget the grid here in Pocatello is a little iffy. It is very. It's a little iffy. Uh, speaking of a little iffy, my co-host Will Neff. All nice right. to be here, Austin. Nice well, Deb, to be here. How, how did you enjoy that live show from San Diego, California? I'll tell you what, it was a really big show. It was a really big show, Will. Really, really, really big show. But let me tell you, we got something else today, and I oh. think it's a, another really big show. I think it's a really big show. A really big show. A round of applause. And we're looking good. We're in the same thing that we've worn for the last seven episodes. That's Don't right. we look good? That's right. That's right. All right. Will, mm. all our contestants are in studio today. Isn't that exciting? It's amazing. It's, it's amazing. So let's, uh, why don't we get to introducing them, shall we? Chad, let's you wanna, do it. Chad, do you want to introduce them? Some of the biggest guests Some we've the, ever had. Oh, yeah. It may, you know what, Will? I'm going to venture to say this could be the biggest show we've ever had. That's right. That's right. The biggest show we've ever had. Yeah. Really big show. Ladies and gentlemen, let's introduce our first contestant. Our first contestant is a huge star. Oh, yes. They are the youngest and fastest persons to hit number one on Twitch, and it's their first time on Name Your Prize. Give it up for Ranbo! Yes! Ranbo! Hey! You look fantastic. Look nice. at this. Thank you. Thank God, you. you are rocking You look that amazing. How, how are you feeling? Welcome back to the United <laughs> States. Oh, oh, be careful there, Ranbo. It's fine. It's fine. It's careful. Okay. I know you don't smoke very no, often. It's fine. I'm getting, getting used to it. Yeah, I know. No, you got to get yeah. your smoker's lungs. Yeah. We've been doing it for a while now. <laughs> How are you feeling? Oh, no, I'm feeling great. I'm ready. Good. You ready, ready to name, you ready to name some prices? Oh, I'm ready. Yeah, would you say would you say you're in touch with the, the, the prices of items? I'd say so. I usually uh, look at them before I buy something. Okay, hey, yeah, he's so. still he's a humble uh, king! He's right humble. Off the top of your head, what's your favorite price? Oh, that's gotta be $4.99. Oh, that's a great price. That's a great price. I don't think we've ever asked that question. No. That, that should be a common that's theme. That's a great price. All right, ladies and gentlemen, our next contestant, he's also a really big star. He's in a will they, won't they with Foolish Gamers. That's Ooh. what he's most known for. Wow. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Puns, everybody. Yes. All right. Yes. Puns, how you doing, Puns? I'm feeling like a million bucks right now, you, Austin. You look like a million bucks, Puns. Yeah. You, you look like a million bucks. You're really fitting the aesthetic, which is current day 70s, which yes. is what we're in right now. Puns, are you pretty good at naming prices of items? Yeah, and I'm pretty good at the prices that are like more than $1,000. Oh, he's rich! Oh. He's rich! What was the last thing that you bought, Puns? Um, I don't know. I usually get stuff for free, so... Oh! Oh my gosh! You think that bodes well for the show? You think you're gonna win today? Um, I'm gonna try my best. He's gonna try his best! Round of applause! Okay! Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, let's give it up for our next contestant. Our next contestant is back for another chance to win, and he still refuses to marry me. Who put yes. that in the teleprompter? I don't know, but he looks like he walked off the set of Top Gun. That's Look right. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for Foolish Gamer! Wow, take it right into the yeah. day. How are you feeling, Foolish? Oh, you... I'm feeling fresh, feeling good. Can I just say, you two are both looking amazing. Oh, oh stop you it. Can keep keep, keep it going. Tell us a little bit more. Listen, the bulge, I could already see oh. it. Oh, oh what are you talking about? What bulge? I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> so, uh, how many points do I get? Uh, <laughs> you know what? Let's start off the show uh, real hot. Ten points for Foolish, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. Thank you, thank you. All right. All right, yeah. Foolish starting off hot with 10 points. No, I'm kidding. We got to take that no away. That's way. cheating. You just ruined your chances. That's cheating. You ruined your chances. Oh, I did. 20 points for Foolish, yeah. everybody. Yeah. 20 points for Foolish. All right. No, we got to take it away. I got to. Despite me, <laughs> despite me ruining my chances, I got to keep up the integrity of the show, all right? Because this show's got a lot of integrity, right? That's right. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Our final contestant says that if he doesn't win the show today, this is big time. 
If he doesn't win the show today, he's going to grow his hair out. Whoa. Yeah. It's true. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise for Name Your Price veteran Jack Manifold. Oh, 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 oh my God. I'm glad to oh, be back in the 70s. Oh, my God. The great God. 70s where we all have great values. That's right. <laughs> Thanks for having me. Back when men were men, That's Jack right. Manifold. Jack Manifold smokes a pack at a time. Yeah. <laughs> give me another cigarette, uh, Bill. Give, give me a fucking <laughs> cigarette. Right, let me get him a another, cigarette. Let me get him another cigarette. He's, my God. He's on edge. God, I miss these <laughs> Fucking things. <laughs> Everyone's on their oath bars, not me. I've got the cigarette. I tell you what. Jack was smoking on the plane here. Yeah, that's right. Absolutely. that's right. Absolutely. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for your cast and name your prize. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Wow, man, you guys look really good. Really, really beautiful cast this week. For a really, 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 really big show. That's right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I imagine in the audience and the contestants, you guys probably want to know how we even play this damn game, right? Yes. 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 Right, chat? Yes. Okay, it's time to go over the rules of Name Your Prize. That's right. Here we go, Will. Oh. Come stand up. Oh. Stand next to me, Will. Oh. Huh? Oh. Oh! Oh, you burn yourself? Oh my god. Alright. There are four rounds in Name Your Price. In round number one, I'm gonna show you a bunch of items we bought online, and you're gonna guess how much we paid for them. In round number two, it's dealer's choice. We'll play several mystery games that have been banned in Europe. Yes. Oh, Absolutely. Yes. I love being here. Yeah, that's right. Great nation. This great nation. That's, that's right. right. <laughs> Round three is... Oh. Chat the bed. Con contestants are asked a question. What? And we'll have to guess which answer they think the chat will choose. Now, Will, this next round is terrifying. Whoa. And I think the music may be switching to reflect that terror. In the final round. Ferdinand, do you have something a little creepier for me? Not creepy enough. Slower. In the final round, <laughs> we bring out the haunted board. Oh, oh God. holy shit! Yeah. Oh my God. My goodness. This is terrifying. I don't think I can oh handle that. Oh Lord. Why is it haunted, Will? I tell you what. They used Jeffrey Dahmer's. <laughs> what did they use? Continue the sentence, Will. <laughs> they used they used a set of crayons they found in Jeffrey Dahmer's apartment oh. to oh. ink the letters. Oh, oh yeah. Wow, that's terrifying. It's dark. The haunted board. Yeah. All right. That's how we guarantee any of you can stay in this game right up until the end of the show. Round of applause. Yeah. All right. Are you guys ready to get into round number one? Oh, let's do it. All right, let's do it. Contestants, I'm going to show you some products. Whoever guesses closest to the price we bought them for, not including tax or shipping, gets 10 points. Okay. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, well, we've got a great surprise for you. Oh, yes. Well, we know you're a family man. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's a sure. family man. So we brought his wife onto the show to be, to bring in the product. Oh, Ladies yeah. and gentlemen, welcome Caroline onto the show, everybody. All oh, right. Dude, that's my, that's my ex-wife. Oh. That's your that's my your ex-wife. That's your what? Ex-wife. That's your what? Ex-wife. This is not my current wife. Well, I'm, I'm so sorry. There seemed to be a little bit of a mix-up. I thought for sure you were married and you were in a happy, loving oh, relationship. No, no, and... no. The succubus stole the best years of my life, Austin, and now she's on my show. Oh, well, I... You know what? You look fat. Oh, 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 my God. Oh, this is delightful. Thank you for this treat, Austin. What a, what a nice surprise. Oh, my God. Well, let me tell you. My robe looks good on you. Oh, thank you. Oh. Oh, did you hear that? Yeah, I'm right next to you. Of course I heard oh, it. Oh, I thought you were losing your hearing. You've gotten so old. Okay, get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Give it up for Caroline, everybody. Will, I'm yeah. so sorry. I didn't know. I don't know. She seems awesome. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. From the listing, here we go. We've got Star Wars glasses. 
These are vintage Star Wars drinking glasses. They oh. come from an exclusive Burger King promo for Star Wars. They are from the year 1977. They ship from Putnam Valley, New York. I'm pretty sure these are the ones that had lead in the paint. <laughs> Does that Wait, make them mark they discontinued them because oh. people would get sick. Oh. Wait, after drinking out of the cups? Oh, yeah, that's that good lead uh, paint. Mm -hmm. No, God, please! Oh, there's <laughs> lead in there. <laughs> definitely lead. Oh, wow, actually, definitely lead. Man, what are you thinking here? <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Seems good quality. That's right. right. Now, now, this is what we paid for the whole set. Do you have any questions about them? I feel that in my heart. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, goodness. <laughs> We've got... I think we're gonna lose You're Jack right? <laughs> We it, we've got how much did we pay for four of them? Think all right, start four thinking. Wait, how four. much did we pay for all four of these? All four of them. Together. Oh, it's like a set. Yep, together. Yep, it's a set. Are they collectible? Um They're Star Wars. They're Star cups. Wars, what do you think? yeah. They're definitely okay. collectible. <laughs> okay. Listen, I'm not like a nerd. Ah, foolish, you're lucky you, know. you look good. Let me tell you. <laughs> Let me tell you, foolish. Not to be an easy show. <laughs> Let me put it this way, Star Wars stuff, arguably the most collectible brand in history. Oh, okay, okay. I was more of a football guy. So yeah, for sure. Yeah, What's know. your team? Um, Browns. How about oh, the Browns? the Browns! <laughs> oh, my God. What else, what else, what other sport do you like, Foolish? Um, I do a little ballet. Oh! Wow! Yeah. Can we get a little step? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, oh my God, Foolish is gonna give us a little ballet. Foolish is gonna get up for him. Okay. okay. This? All right. I said give it up for him! Yeah. 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 I like, to, uh, I like to do like one of these to start a little oh, oh. stretch, and oh. then and then here if you little could, uh, oh. if you could. Oh, a little partner's nutcracker. Oh, oh, oh whoa, oh. Austin, oh. you're even more riveting up close. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, no, um, no, we shouldn't. Like that'd be ridiculous. Uh, Wow, well, I'm a little distracted. I love. Was that ballet? I, I love ballet. <laughs> ballet. I don't think that was ballet. Ballet of the heart. Ballet is well. my favorite sport. Did you know that? Oh, really? Oh yeah, I was starting quarterback for my ballet team in high school. Wait, that's incredible. Yeah. yeah. How many points do I get? Oh, uh, I don't know. We'll have to see. All right, all right. We'll have to see. We have to wait till after the show. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh. All right. We'll show you his black swan. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, let's start guessing the prices. Yeah, write them down, folks. Write them down. 500. 500. No, you can't. Don't shout them out, oh, foolish. Okay. People can copy it. Well, I, I don't have a marker. People can copy it. You don't have a marker? Uh, okay. Okay. All right, think of your prices. Hey, yo. All right, think real long and hard. All right. Ooh. All right. Collectible Star Wars glasses. We're only one item in. Yes. <laughs> we are off the rails, baby. Oh, yeah. My kind of show, really big show. Okay, really are we showing them? Like, is it? All right, I'll go one by one. Oh. All right, let's start with Ranbu. How much do you think it costs? All right. So uh, the date here says uh, 1977. That's, That's correct. correct. So I'm gonna say uh, $85. $85. Smackerinos. Oh, oh. All right. Was there any correlation between <laughs> those two things? I added eight. <laughs> oh. I see. All right, well, all right, puns. What do you got? I didn't do that much research on it, but I just guessed fourteen ninety nine. Fourteen ninety nine. Ninety nine. All right, foolish. All right. What do you got? You told me they're highly collectible. Oh yeah. All right. Yep. Four hundred nineteen and twelve cents. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Wow. A hundred wow. bucks a glass. That's incredible. Jack Manifold, what do you think? These came out the year Star Wars came out, so they're original. For all right. That's right. I all think right. they're worth. One hundred and twenty-five dollars. Chat, which one? Who do you guys think it was correct? You're supposed to like make a good guess. All right, Jack, it was uh, a good guess. Oh, incorrect. I'm sorry. Ooh. Oh God. Foolish gamers, I'm gonna come back to you. Oh. Puns incorrect. Oh. Damn it. Between Ranbu and Foolish, one of you got it correct, and it is Ranbu. Ten points. Actual price ninety-nine ninety-nine. Yeah. All right. I'll leave you with the lead glasses. 99, 99. You guys can keep them. You can. We're gonna send them home to you. Oh. Everybody's right. going home with a glass. I adore lead. Hello, Caroline. That's unfortunate. Gosh. Yeah, that was a terrible guess, by the way. I mean, yours was you yours was awful. Mine, 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 mine actually was a decent guess. Just to be what? Clear. It's gotta look like Medusa. Right All right, let's bring out the next item. Here we go. That's crazy. Bring it on out. Bring it out. Bring it out. We'll get this later. Oh. What the hell is that? Ladies and gentlemen. Where does that go? Oh my god. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> this next item is 
Oh, hello. <laughs> All right. This is a June Taylor sewing ham holder. Oh. It has a ham number 315 pressing aid mold. We literally thought this thing held a huge ham when you slice it, but turns out it doesn't. What is a ham holder? Yeah, what does it do? That's just a dinosaur yeah. tooth or something. It just like holds a ham? You see us right there. Oh, that's okay. I know, we really should keep things quiet. That's okay, yeah, we will. I know, we, he shouldn't know. I'll see you during the next Caroline, time. he's gay as a $2 unicorn. I'm not threatened at all. She doesn't know that. <laughs> she doesn't know oh. that. Don't let him stop what we have. Homophobia in the 70s what? is still not cool. Thank you. I got homophobia. Thank you, Caroline. Oh, God. All right. That's right. Sorry. Okay, this right here. Is a ham holder. Do you know what a ham holder is? No. It holds is that, ham. Like, no, it doesn't. Does it hold? It looks doesn't like it holds. We ham. thought we thought it's it held point. ham. Turns out, it's actually to help you iron out wrinkles of unwieldy clothing. Why is it called a ham holder? Wait, so what you, you is, throw is wrinkly clothing? clothes in there? Why is there a bike seat in it though? Yeah. <laughs> this is literally you would take your clothes and you would wrap it around this thing and you would iron them. I have no idea. I see why I didn't laugh. How would that remove creases? No, the, I don't know. I think it would create a lot of creases, right? Is that like a look? I have no idea. Oh. We, none of us have any idea, but this is what it is. It's a ham holder. You want to you feel it? Or oh, please. Feel it? I would yeah. love to feel it. I'd love to feel it. Uh, I'd love ham. to feel your ham. Oh, there you go. Oh, oh let me feel that. your ham. Oh, is that part of it? Okay. Yeah, this is part of it right here. Okay. Take a look. They're very Those light still object. exist? Somebody in the chat knew yeah. what they were to yeah, begin yeah, yeah. with. Oh, let me, uh, does this open? Do you like? No, none of them open. No, okay. Nope, nope. So like, do you iron it like when it's together or is it like you just- We don't know. <laughs> we have no idea. We literally thought like, it this, held ham. We <laughs> thought it held ham, which okay. is what we bought it for, but we turned out it had a completely different purpose. Okay. Yep. All right. Chat, have you ever seen this before? Mm-mm-mm-mm. Um, so like, what are you thinking, Ranbu? You, you seem don't to copy Ranbu. He's uh, in the don't league. Don't copy me, man. All right, guess Why your prices. You? Okay, guess um, your prices. There's not really much to gauge off of this. It's gonna be at least four hundred. I tell you what. Let me tell you something. It's more than a dollar. Okay. Okay. I need a mark. And less than a thousand dollars. Wait. I'll give you a good window there. More than a dollar, less than a thousand dollars. Is there another marker that we can get, or like a cigarette or something? Uh, can we get another marker in here, please? <laughs> yeah. Thank Wait, you. awesome. I see what Who you did it? there, though. That was a good hint. What? I followed. No, I Thank saw you. what you, you did got there. It? Yeah. I really got you on the right track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. No, um, I, oh, here it is. Wait, I want my marker back. I gave it to you. Let me have, with, no, I want Rambo's in the lead with 10 points. Wait, that one's, I'll take this one. All right, Rambo gets it right again. All right, his you guys got your guesses? You ready? Yeah. Okay. Absolutely. All right, Jack, let's start with you. Well, how much do you think this costs? I think a great piece of ham needs to be held securely. $17.99. So $17.99. Okay. All right, foolish. All right, so you said less than, like, more than a dollar. More than a dollar. More than a dollar, less than a thousand. What to you try think? to throw everyone off. Yes. So that's why I took the hint. 50 cents. 50 cents. What? Why would he lie about that? <laughs> well, no, but we have like a connection. Like he told me he'd give me hints throughout the show. Oh, so that was like, like you're giving him hints. Yeah. Wait, where am I? Feel it, foolish. I was really trying to help out here, but no, that's why I picked up on it. All right, we'll see if it. you got closest okay. uh, puns. How much? Um, I went with an actual intellectual guess as opposed to that guy. Mm. Ten dollars. Ten dollars. Ten dollars. This man holds ham. I do. All right. On the daily. Uh, Ranbu, what do you think? All right, so I think that that's vintage, right? I think that there's few of those left. Okay. Right? There's got to be few of those left, which is why sure. I went with uh, $40. $40. It's Ranbu, a piece of work. You know, foolish. Yeah. You got it wrong. I'm sorry. What? Okay, I, it was a mystery. It was a mystery. 50, oh. It wasn't even close. You oh, got to keep in okay. tune with it. I'm going to give you hints more throughout the show. Thank that you. Wasn't Thank one you. Of them. Okay. okay, okay. Jack, Ooh. incorrect. Oh. Ooh. Puns incorrect. Ran to another 10 points! Wow, actual price $64.99. Desperate need to hold ham. I don't know. I have no idea. But let me tell you, there's one ham on here that I want to hold. Oh. <laughs> Ladies and well. gentlemen, when we come back, we'll see if Ranbu continues to pile on the points. On Name Your Prize. We'll be right back. Woo!
name hey, your price. price. Jack, get, get my microphone. Come on, Jack. Get back on. Uh, it was pretty good. Get back. You're pretty right, good, though. Not bad. Not bad. My microphone back. Jack, give it up for Jack Manifold, everybody. Woo! All right. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, our next item is a real treat. Ooh, wow. You know, I put my address on here. You seem to have lost it, because I haven't seen a dime. Oh, well, listen, Austin hasn't paid me in a long time, all right? We got, there's show business, baby. We got to make sure that we have trailers and, and drugs and drugs. drugs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Always an excuse. You see this? What, your name's Foolish? Was, yeah. Your name's Foolish? Yeah. I'm Foolish, too. I'm Foolish for everything, that son of a... Oh. Look what you did to me. Uh, Will, Look what she did to I me. I thought she was your current wife. This was my safe space. I thought, well, yes, I know. <laughs> Clearly, it's not very safe. I, she she applied, and she said, I'm his current wife, and this is just what oh, I thought. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have a real treat. This auction involves two brothers who moved to Vegas. Is there supposed to be a music change here? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. This auction involves two brothers who moved to Vegas. One thought he'd try his luck in the casinos. The other took his talents to the stage. Behold, the famous Vegas Rodent Brothers. All right. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I can't wow, look at these boys right here. All righty. Oh, Siegfried and Roy. Oh, look at that, huh? Oh, my God. Look at that right there. Look at these. Oh, this guy's got a future on Twitch. Oh, he does. Look at <laughs> Playing the slots. That's right. Yes, he does. All right. Take a look here. We've got the Rodent Brothers. This one's not... Oh, there's this one. This one's a magician, and this one's a gambler. This one's hairline oh. is receding as well. Okay. Were these real at any point? Oh, uh, yes. yes. Oh, they right. were. Those are real. Okay. They were born oh, and raised in New York. They're still oh. real. They're just yeah, dead. They, yes. No, they smell real. But I, I can assure oh. the audience oh, they, they died of yeah. natural causes. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, they yeah. really do smell <laughs> real. Yeah. Oh, yes. They died of what they die of, Will? Uh, this one had a heart attack when he came back okay. and saw that one banging his wife. Oh, my oh. God. Oh, my goodness. That is oh, a very tragic story. Yeah. Yep. It's a very tragic story. Wait, yeah, how the other? In, happens in right in nice communities all the time. Wait, hold on just a second. So if this one came back, which one came back? And, uh, was you know, the magician, of course. The magician. He's the cuck. The magician had a heart attack yeah. while this guy was banging his wife. Yeah. Right? Okay. Now, the question is, oh, hold on. Hey, camera. Can we, can we show? So I'm pointing to the right one. This one, this one right here. Yes. That's the magician. He was the getting his wife banged by this one right here. Yep. Right, this one right over here. Oh. This one right over here. There the we gambler. go. The gambler. The gambler. Now, what this one die of? He was banging the wife. He achieved climax. He was overweight. So he died. <laughs> he died of a heart attack by watching, and he died of Oh, yeah, it was climax. tragic. They died within minutes of each other. Oh, my God. Oh, what man. a you know? Wait, did she? Did someone say banging his wife? Oh. <laughs> She's got a tagline now? <laughs> All right. All right. All right, so how much do you guys think that we paid for both of these? Do you have any questions about them? So it's like a set, no. two, two for one kind of deal? like. Yeah, two for one. We got two for one. Okay. Are there like other dead bang mice wife cheaters out there? Like, is that a collectible thing? Is this set? a whole thing? <laughs> yes, it's, it's, it's a, a whole set. set. <laughs> okay. You got to catch them all like Pokemons. <laughs> it's called the Rodent Infidelity set. <laughs> it's 30 pieces. I kind of want one, actually. Yeah. They're made by Hummel, and you can collect them around Christmas. That's right. I would okay. pray for one of these dirty little rats in my stack. That's right. I was a little boy. That's right. Um, all right. How much did both cost, collectively? Both okay. cost, okay. Oh, yeah, look at that. <laughs> Infidel. The infidelity rat pack. Oh, we're not talking that, about like, we're not well, talking about Frankie. Shouldn't smoke with the marker this close to my fucking face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Getting a head That's rush. Recipe Careful for disaster. There, Careful there, Jack. <laughs> Jack has ingested lead, embalming fluid from the rats, and now he's huffing markers. He's on another planet. A nice smell, yeah. man. I like this. All right. Oh, Looks like Puns and Ranbu have locked in their answers. Unbelievable. Foolish doesn't even know where he's at. <laughs> he looks good, doesn't he? I mean, it's just. Ooh. Yeah. It looks real good. <laughs> All right, Jack. 
Okay. We're ready to reveal our answers. Can we get oh, yeah. some thinking music, Ferdinand, please? All right. Hey, it's a thinking police choice. <laughs> My thoughts are running right, away from me. There we go. There we go. Here we go. Let's start with puns. What do you think? Um, I had no idea, but I just went with the idea of like 100 each, so 200. 200 dollars. Oh. All right. Well, puns, you say you get a lot of stuff for free. Have you ever received an infidelity rodent as a gift? Well, I know in the rich community, like, a lot of people collect dead animals, like, cremated. Yes. So, Taxidermy. Um, Wait, they, yeah. they cremated? <laughs> cremated. Oh. Cremated should be dust. Oh. That's right. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, animal mistake. dust in You know, I knew you this know. rich guy that posted up a uh, cremated grizzly bear in his oh, living room. Really? just ashes everywhere. Oh, yeah, snorted it. Yeah, that's right. There's <laughs> not well, much up there. Well, you know, I didn't go to school. Okay. I just became rich. All right. Oh, oh, hey. uh, $200. $200. $200. $200. All right, Foolish. Foolish, you were in a frat, weren't you? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Right. Which one? So, going with a clean answer of $32. $32. $32 and a wave. Uh -huh. thought behind that. $32. No, not a single one. Jack, Jack uh -huh. Manifold, what do you think? <laughs> <laughs> Jack's barely you know, on. If there's anything I know about Austin, it's infidelity. Oh! With my great knowledge of this subject, I know that the mouse is actually much less expensive than other types of ro rodents, like the rat or even the great what, capybara. I don't fucking know. Yes! Either way, that is a rodent. <laughs> the point is... These aren't too expensive, but they're still expensive. So 98.20 is my 98, 20. 20 just undercutting puns. Ranbu, okay. That's you up. have 20 points here. Yeah. What do you think? Don't have much to lose, honestly. No, so don't. I just uh, went with 150. Then I drew 150. him. I drew him. 150, and you I drew him. I'm going to give you five extra points if you got it right, because that's a beautiful drawing. Oh, what? so now we're just handing out free points? Don't worry, Polish. You'll get yours. Uh, okay. Let's see a good drawing over there. <laughs> Ranbu, you get this correct, you'll be the only person with points. Unfortunately, you got it incorrect. Oh. <laughs> hey, Ranbu. Hey, Rambo. Fuck that guy. <laughs> oh, we got a little tension on the panel, Whoa. Will. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I won't even look at you. Jack. To put that finger away, because you also got it incorrect. Oh. oh, God. It must be tough being an idiot. <laughs> Foolish, it must be tough, because you also got it incorrect. Puns! Puns, you got 10 points! Who needs school? Who needs school? Actual I don't need school. Cost, a lot of people $222 need and 99 cents. That's right. All righty. Oh, 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 careful. I got to put it out. There we go. Here, do you need one? I can. Oh, you do need. Do you yeah, need did it? you wanna? That Another? dirty rat's oh, for I you. Oh, I wasn't talking to you. Oh, thank I was. You. I made it for you. Thank you, thank you. I lo love a good. A dirty one. rat deserves a dirty rat. That's right. Yes, I, I know, I know. Thank you, thank you. Should we be here for did this? Did you cheat or? on your wife, Will? Uh, I creatively placed my penis. <laughs> oh, you know what? I don't think that's cheating. <laughs> No! He didn't either. Oh. He didn't either. Oh my gosh, he didn't. Well. So do you think he creatively placed his penis? Creatively placed. He's never once creatively placed his penis. <laughs> oh my. Let me tell you, okay? Well, yeah. Wow. You he place places her, his you penis like a five-year-old draws a picture of the sky. Oh, oh. <laughs> Well, I'm kind of enjoying this. I'm not going to lie. It's beautiful. <laughs> All right, here we go. Our next items here. We got something. We got something interesting to play on Name Your Price. Okay. Ooh. Fuck these monsters. These are Pez dispensers. We're going to play something called the Pez Challenge. All right. Each of you will choose a Pez dispenser. Whatever we paid for the one you choose, you get that many points. All right. Contestants, you will be selecting from the Joker, the Batman, and the Penguin, okay? Ooh. So you're all guaranteed points here, although some of these are more expensive than the others. So for oh. example, 
If we paid $3 for this one, you'd get three points. If we paid $5 for this one, you'd get five points. If you paid $7 for that one, we'd pay, you'd get seven points. Those are random point values and not associated with the actual value of what we paid for those pesos. Is that like the hint? No, it wasn't. <laughs> Is that? Uh, okay. okay. Want to know how I got these pets? <laughs> <laughs> My father had a sweet tooth. <laughs> All right, next uh, <laughs> one here. Oh. How much? Or which? Just choose a Pez. Don't even. You don't even need to guess the price. Batman. Yeah. Batman for foolish. <laughs> Doesn't waste a second. He's locked in. Yeah. He's already locked Batman in. for yeah. foolish. Batman. The now Joker, what? baby. The, jo the Joker, baby. Wait, what's the other one besides those two? The Punch. The fuck? No, like, what's the other one? Oh. The penguin. What's that? <laughs> oh, a, my God. You guys can choose the same one if you'd like. The penguin? Oh. He's a crime boss in Gotham. I, no. oh. Oswald Cobblepot. <laughs> yes. I'll take Batman. 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 Two Batmans. One Joker. Okay. Wait, you can't just... Rambo, what do you think? I don't... I I'm going to say, I think that the other two, while in their production line, there are a lot more made of them, meaning Ooh. there's a lot less of the penguin, so I'm going to... Wow! Get the penguin! If I'm wrong, then I'm really stupid. All right, nobody's incorrect. You're all getting points. Some are getting more than others, though. Who chose the Joker? I chose the Joker. This Joker over Jack, there. I'm going to award you with 275 points. We paid... What? We paid $275 for this Joker right here. The Joker, baby. Did you guess? We love the Joker. What'd you put? I put Batman. All right, you put Batman. You two put Batman. Uh huh. You gentlemen, 249 points. Okay. 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 Uh, I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, no, that's cool. And Ranbu. I made a mistake, didn't I? <laughs> you you made a huge mistake. mistake. Points. I thought I was being smart. 239 Ooh. points. Oh, he fell off. Oh, it's not a he bad fell actually. off. He fell off. 239 he points. Now, here's the deal. As you can tell, we've had a little bit of a shift. Puns and Ranbu are all of a sudden tied at 259. Yep. Jack is taking the lead at 275. And Foolish is still looking good. All right, here we go. When we come back, Caroline. we're going to head right into our second round of the show. Stick around with more Name Your Prize. Seriously, you so All right, everybody. Welcome back to Name Your Prize. All right. As our contestants puff on their cigarettes, it's time for us to wheel out the cart for round number two. Here we go. Oh, a joy quite like our... Here we go. Oh, and nothing's on the cart except these cards right here because we're about to play Dealer's Choice. Oh. $35. $35? Isn't this show name your price? Yes, it is. Oh. $35. Foolish, what do you think? Yeah, sure. All right, you have to wait till after the show for that. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up. Round of applause. Okay. You just signed up. Hey, you got that money on my show that goes towards alimony. Is allowed to be on air? Or... <laughs> All right. We're going to play a bunch of different games. The first game is called What They Do. What They Do. And the, this game is worth 20 points. So what we're going to do is we're going to show you an image of a person, and you're going to have to tell me what they do? What they do? Oh. Whoever answers correctly will win 20 points. It's going to be up on this monitor. Foolish, you look like you don't know what the hell's going on. I was just, you took the words right out of my mouth. I was about to just say, like, what? I don't think what? he even knows what the $35 is for. So yeah, foolish. <laughs> 35 <laughs> bucks? Yeah? You're driving the price of dick down, buddy. I thought she was just going <laughs> to give me $35. Give me like <laughs> I thought she was just going to give me $35. No, no. Foolish. No. Oh. What was that all no. about? You poor, well, poor Well, you're going to be getting no. $35 no. now. I just don't know if you like the means. <laughs> oh, OK. All right, let's put it up on the screen right over here, folks. There it is. <laughs> so that's so we're gonna show you a picture of this guy right here. No, we're gonna ask you what he do. What he do? <laughs> we're gonna give you a multiple choice, okay? Uh -huh. Did he a have 50 wheels of contraband cheese seized by Border Patrol? That's a lot of cheese. Did he b get arrested for selling human body parts oh. on Facebook? Yeah. Or Facebook. c get an emotional support alligator who sleeps in the same bed? Um, what do you think? What they do, Ranboo? What do you think? Okay. 
Well, judging by how they uh they Oh shoot. actually write down all your answers. Oh, okay. Write down, right, write down right, all your answers. Right, right. Okay. Write down all your answers. Um think long and hard. Does he look like a cheese wheel man to you, Rambo? Not really. Not really. Seeing as how he's around other people. That's also. true. But I mean well, he also is accused of selling yeah, human that's body That's where you would get those body parts around that's other people. That's true. What do you think the most expensive body part would be on Facebook? Um, I can't believe you can get away with that. On well, Facebook? The yeah. balls. The balls? <laughs> Clearly not in your case, $35. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> That's true. Bucks. I'll pay 40 uh, Are you outbidding my ex-wife? Yes, I am. <laughs> All right. What? All right. What? A, B, or C. All right. You, okay. Let's reveal our answer, starting with Ranboo. All right. What do you think this guy did? Okay. Let's show him on the screen real quick. What did they do? That man, all right, he's smiling. He looks like he just slept with an alligator. I'm going to say C. C, okay. Good answer. Good answer. All right. Puns, what do you um, think? I wasn't sure about the alligator one, and also, like, the body part seems a little too extreme, so I went with A. Just a, okay. Contraband cheese by Border Patrol. Foolish, what do you think? I figured, like, if I was an alligator, like, I'd probably snuggle with them. Okay. So I went with has su emotional support alligator who... You wrote the whole answer instead of just writing the letter, huh? Foolish, you could have just put C. <laughs> oh, wait, I, did, I honestly did not see those letters. No I worries, didn't know how no to... Worries. Did you think we had to write down the entire they, thing? No, they just looked like little, like, font. They, they just what did like you think when they everyone just, else was saying... Did you not look at anyone else? <laughs> they hardly look like letters. They just like little squiggles. Listen, that is what words is? are. <laughs> I'm going to tell you right now, that guy's smiling too much to have slept with an alligator. I slept with one for years, and now she's a guest on my show. Oh! Oh! oh. Yeah. Surely she won't come out here and say anything about that. Surely she won't. No, she won't have... Oh, oh there God, she is. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh. Surely you weren't talking about me because there were a lot of alligators that you were sleeping with. Oh! You know, I'm a crocodile, baby. Oh! What is that? My God! What does that mean? What? <laughs> How does that change? Shut up, it sounded badass! It's still a lizard. <laughs> All right. The difference is Either alligator opens lizards. their mouth up. Uh, crocodile opens their mouth down. Wait, actually. And you can tell because she never shuts the fuck up. <laughs> but I don't understand what happened. It still doesn't make any sense. <laughs> All right, Jack Manifold, A, B, or C. I come from a land of many cheeses. Yeah, that's right. Brooklyn, New York. Yeah, Brooklyn, New York. Uh, let me right. tell you. The home of cheese. <laughs> the home of cheese, baby. Every single kind. That's let right. Let me tell you. I know a thing or two about a man that steals some cheese. Okay. And that's a motherfucker. Like this guy. Right. cheese. Okay, A. 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 Let me tell you. The cheese wheel bandit. We got foolish correct. Bram is correct. Yes. yes. The rest of you are incorrect. This man has an emotional support alligator who sleeps he in his head. Yeah. Damn I'm it. Better he than had that glow to him. I'm better than all of you. What emotion is it regulating in him? I have yeah. no idea, but <laughs> foolish, you just uh, got yourself into second place. No surprise. I always show up late. All right, let's bring up the next. Let's bring on okay. the next. What they do? Hey, awesome. What they do? What he do? What he do? What'd they do? Did they... The cake says, Happy 60th birthday, Dwayne, and it's got a pumpkin on it. <laughs> Did they... Cause Did they thousands and thousands, thousands, thousands in damages by clogging several toilets? A. B. Throw, throw a cake at the Mona Lisa while wearing a wig. Or C. Paddle 38 miles down the Missouri River and an 846-pound pumpkin. It's very specific. Uh, oh, yeah. That one is uh, oddly specific. Write down what you think is the correct answer. Uh, let's go ahead and write down okay. those answers. Very oddly specific. Um, mm -hmm. Or D, did oh. they go out for a pack of Marlboros one night and never come back? That's completely untrue. They were parliaments. <laughs> <laughs> well, my God, I'm learning a lot about you, and I'm not sure I like it. You got skeletons. I see who comes in and out of your dressing room. <laughs> Look, it was one time. It was one time. It was the Why sound cut to me. <laughs> it, was, it wasn't even anything. 
It was not me that came in and out of the dressing room. I just want to clear that up. Today. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's reveal their answers. What do you think, Foolish? Let's start with you. Uh, I'm superstitious. I wrote it out again. Caused thousands in damages by clogging several toilets. So you're Toilets. gonna ignore the pumpkin on the cake and just guess that this guy's a big shitter. I just I just figured that was to throw you off. I mean, I'm honestly, Will, with the, with the cake, that could cause, that could be a laxative cake. A pumpkin laxative cake? Yes, everybody you knows. You think that he juiced that thing with laxatives? Yes, so I think, out yeah, yes. All right. I think he's into that kind of thing. Toil. All right. <laughs> so you think A, puns, what do you think? Uh, I don't have a reason for my answer, uh, but I picked C. What about the pumpkin on the cake? What do you mean there's that a is pumpkin? The pumpkin? That's the pumpkin answer. That's what he put. Oh. What he put. No, I know you said you didn't have a reason. Well, I guess <laughs> I said like a, that's a, a pretty bit. good reason. Well, I mean, I kind of just went with my gut feeling. Like, I didn't really think about it too much. Rambo. Okay, fair, fair. Rambo, what do you think? Speaking of uh, gut feelings, I'm gonna go with A. Ooh, another. I think that it's all red herrings. All right. <laughs> okay. Why? Why would you put a pumpkin on someone else's birthday cake if it was your accomplishment? Oh, that's fair. I would assume he is Maybe Dwayne. Maybe this guy doesn't have much of a personality. Oh, he might, he might be Dwayne. Oh, life. it might be I'm his assuming name. he is Dwayne. I did not think about that, actually. Despite this. Uh, <laughs> I picked A because he looks what? like he shits big. <laughs> so no one guessed that he <laughs> threw this cake at the Mona Lisa, by the way. All no. right. Well, Will, you were on to something about the pumpkin. Because that's correct, puns. 20 points. Everybody else yes. incorrect. <laughs> There's I didn't a think... picture of him in the pumpkin. It says I... the SS Berta. I... I didn't know pumpkins get that big. I mean, he, he, he paddled 38 miles down the Missouri River. Missouri. In a 846 pound pumpkin. That was a good pronunciation, Austin. Thank you. The Missouri. Missouri. Okay, I'm sorry, but uh, you told you like you told us you wouldn't be giving hints. Then you threw a whole pumpkin on the cake. It I just, just kind of seems like. like I hope you make this up guy never and... watches this show because. He's gonna learn that everybody thinks that he has a face that makes him look like he shits in public bathrooms <laughs> and destroys them. Even though he's holding the evidence that he's gotten a pumpkin. I just didn't think that he's it like, was no, that guy, that guy shits. That was an I overwhelming just... shit face. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Will? Yeah. What'd they do? Oh, what this guy do? What'd this guy do? Chuck McGill. <laughs> oh my God. It looks like he. I don't know. We'll see. It looks like he uh, maybe he appeared on Shark Tank and pitched a golf club that you can use as a urinal. Ooh, oh, wow. That's smart. I think Time saving. He may have sued uh, his son for $650,000 for not bearing children. Stop. Oh, okay. what? Mm. Mm. He also could have been the guy that threatened to turn their plane around if passengers didn't stop air dropping nudes to each other. Oh. Can you repeat number two? You were in his plane, Austin? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do do that sometimes. Yeah, do you? Just see who receives them. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, dangerous. Very dangerous. Uh, the, B was, did they sue their son for $650,000 for not bearing children? Um, okay, he's wearing a suit, so, like, it looks like he's, you know, has some has some good ideas. Okay, write down your answer for oh, us, so I, oh. Talk me, your opponent, <laughs> through your thought process. Um, so he likes process. pumpkins. Ah. So just... <coughs> mm, chat seems to be split on this one. Any C's in the chat? I forgot chat was right there. That's Don't look at chat. Wait, why not? It's cheating. <laughs> it's cheating. Don't look at it. Uh, no looking at chat. How many unsolicited nudes do you think it would take for a pilot to break? <laughs> <laughs> why are they... Why would they be on their phone? Where do you think he was flying to? Where he just We're came. coming into DC, the weather is about. Oh God, another dick! <laughs> We're going back That's to Atlanta. It. What an interesting, what an interesting reason to divert the plane. Yep. <laughs> oh man. All right. Let's start with Jack Manifold. My first thought when I looked at this guy is he's a lawyer. Yep. Immediate lawyer vibes. He's got him. Lawyers are evil scum that would sue their children, so I went for B. Oh, B! I like that answer. Foolish, what do you think? I, the, the, the Shark Tank answer. 
I'm That's right. That's incredible. Hey! Hey, all right. Yeah. Huns, what do you That's think? That's a good drawing of a shot. Thank though. you, thank uh, you. I went with B for similar reasons as uh, Jack Man. All right. Man Boo, what do you think? That camera's high quality. He's been on Shark Tank. I'm going to say A. Hey. Oh. Wow. Foolish and Ranbu got something going on. They're both correct. Yeah. Yeah. 20 yeah. points, both of you. Nice job. That's right. That's he was right. on Shark Tank. He pitched a golf club that you could pee into. How convenient, Will. Uh, yeah, I mean, I guess you're already out there in nature. That's right. You might just... as well just whip it on out and pee into the golf. Why don't you just... Wait, that's what yeah, I'm you saying. Wait, wait, hold on, just do, you like, do you like put it in or do you like pee what? into it? Well, I don't understand why you wouldn't just pee on a tree or something. Can you, can you I guess swing you don't want it. that sweet, sweet pee pee. Wait, what do you mean? Can you swing? Oh, with yeah, can you it? imagine can you swing can you like attach it and oh. You pee in the wide shot, but, but do you hold the pee in there? Surely you empty it out. Somewhere. Oh, you hold the pee in there. Oh. Why don't you ask Will? He sure did stick his thing between a lot of trunks. Oh. 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 That one hardly even works. <laughs> Splinters. Yes, it does. <laughs> wow, Will, I'm starting to really think differently of you. Yeah. Are you? Yes. Because yeah, you know me, somebody who hasn't stuck my tree between many trunks. <laughs> Your tree? <laughs> what the hell is going on? <laughs> it's a really weird show. <laughs> it's a weird one today. All right. Correct, Foolish, you are still behind Ranbu, who is in the lead. Will, I think we got somebody else on the screen. Oh, God, my oh. other ex-wife. Whoa, oh. wow. Okay. I'm sure they did. What did they do? <laughs> what, did, what did they do? I'm sure they didn't do anything bad, right? Maybe they threw rideshare scooters off an overpass, causing a pileup. Okay. I don't think that's what it was. Wait. Where did he get uh, the face paint? Okay, uh, I've got my card doesn't match the monitor. Were they arrested for stealing Pokemon cards from Burger King? Okay. Or were they arrested for selling golden tickets to heaven? <laughs> or firing crossbows into a White Castle after being denied a refund? Um, <laughs> Listen, okay. I don't mean Holy to help, shit. but this is the most C answer I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> that, that guy fires crossbows. Um... Awesome, is that a diversion or is am I supposed to put C? Foolish, I can't tell you. Oh, okay. I can't tell you because I know the answer. Oh, I don't know the answer. I'm just Will doesn't know the dog. answer. Will knows oh. the answer. He would choose double D. Oh yeah, true. That is that is true. That's not an answer. <laughs> That's not an answer right now. I don't think you can choose twice. <laughs> what happened between you two? I fucked around. I think he, I think he cheated. Hey, foolish, what do you want? Oh, I, I just could not tell. Uh, good for you. <laughs> All right. I wang out and fuck my way around Pocatella. <laughs> that's right. Everybody knows Will around Pocatella. Yeah, that's right. And then we invited her on the show. Yeah, you did. I did. That wasn't very friendly of you. I thought she was your current wife. Well, come to find out on the break, you were not even married. No, fair. Good mistake. Fair How mistake. How many kids you guys have together? Uh, Three. Three? Three? <clears throat> it's two. It's two. It's two. She's giving me that look. It's two. Oh. Three and a half. Oh. Uh, oh. Remember how many kids we have? Three and a half? Oh, How's that even possible? I don't know. I don't want to know what happened to that kid. That's maybe why I left. <laughs> Did it stop midway? All right. <laughs> Never quite left. <laughs> All right. Puns, let's get your answer first. What do you think? What'd they do? Um... I think no matter what they did, they were on drugs. But yes. I think C, because it's cooler than everything else. C? All right, Foolish, what do you think? Um, I'm going to also go with C. OK. Just do that right there. I watched. Jack, watch, what do you think? <laughs> watch you do it right there. Hey, it's, I'm thinking C. Ranbu? C as well. Look. Upside down. <laughs> All of you are incorrect. It's B, isn't it? I fucking knew it was B. I was oh, gonna my that goodness. Too. They got arrested for selling golden tickets to heaven. What does that even mean? How do you get arrested for that? That's what I was thinking. I yeah, but how, how do they, hold on, just a second. Realistically, how do, that, how do they know that they aren't selling actually golden tickets to heaven? Yeah. How yeah. do they know that God didn't come How and, do you get arrested for that? Yeah, how is that illegal? How did God, how do they know that these weren't the chosen ones by God? Put them up on the screen. It was selling them for 99 dollars 99 <laughs> 
Oh, man. Heaven's not cheap, I tell you Which what. Which implies that people bought the $99.99 per ticket, huh? Huh. It's cheaper than... Isn't that what, what? churches do? It's yeah. cheaper than Disneyland. I can tell you that much. True. My gosh. Yeah, but they have... They have that Dole Whip, which is pretty good. Yeah, that's that very true. Good. All right, let's look at these points real quick. Ranboo's in the lead with 299 points. Foolish right behind him with 289. Woo! Puns in third place with 279. And Manifold in last place with 275. But let me tell you, folks, it's anybody's game when we come back for more Name Your Price. Woo! All right, everybody. That was a funky ad break, I can tell you. <laughs> How are you, Kenny? Yeah, I'm sorry, Will. I got a little carried away with myself. Oh, yeah. Sometimes you just got to catch the beat. You know what I mean? That's right. I caught it behind the curtain. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Name Your Price. Yeah. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, we got a really funky game for you guys to play next. It's called Certified Fresh. Ooh, yeah. Ooh. <laughs> this is how it works. We're going to bring out some sealed food products in their original packaging. Based on looks and looks alone, you're going to have to tell me the month and year that this particular food item expired. Oh, hmm. okay. Whoever guesses the closest will win 20 points. Ooh, Ooh. yes. Okay. Let's bring out that first item, ladies and gentlemen. Here we oh, go. Yes. Austin, I'm still breathless. Oh. Me too. <laughs> oh it was awesome watching. I'm also breathless. Oh my God. Throw me another one of those cigarettes. <laughs> I gotcha. <coughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, oh, good catch. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. This first item is called the Simpsons cereal. No problemos. No problemos. There are frosted multigrain cereal loops with mini chocolatey biscuits. It contains 25% uh, of your daily needs of six essential B vitamins. And it's expired, folks. Very Take a look expired. at that. Uh, I'm gonna walk it's this also around. a cereal from the United Kingdom. Oh. Oh, so it's terrible. <laughs> Good cereal, cereal from the United I would Kingdom, imagine. Folks. <laughs> um, okay. Oh, fuck are those little black. Biscuits. Mini chocolatey biscuits. Mm, all right. Yummy. <laughs> I just want to say this may be older than all of you. Is it older than you? <laughs> you see, so I, I still want the free points. I don't. Oh, nice. You can't insult me for points. <laughs> bam, bam, and bounce. What year and month do you think this expired in? Ooh. Oh God. Think about this. Is it possible that it's not expired? No. No. Okay. I like how you're always looking for a gotcha. Uh, okay. <laughs> um. Wait, what year was it founded? Or not like not like founded? The Simpsons. Simpsons. Not like what? Like was there like a date? Did you give us a date? Like, like of when it started? Like. I don't know what you're asking for. <laughs> like how old is the box? Like I don't want to guess like 1930 and then like get it wrong. You think they made Simpsons cereal in 1930? It was just an you example. Think they were on the beaches fighting Hitler, was, and they I were just, like, "Let's make Simpsons cereal." Baby, it's yeah. about as old as our marriage lasted. So the the uh, the age of the cereal is as long as our marriage lasted. And let me tell you, it wasn't very long. So oh. okay. Didn't you guys oh. say you were never married? Listen, it's, it was a weird time for me. I did a lot of ayahuasca back then. And, uh, ayahuasca? Yeah. Isn't that a yeah. state? You, you were going. Well, yeah, I was having spirit. Vision. How often were you hitting up the Amazon? Is that what her name was, ayahuasca? <laughs> yeah, there you go. Yeah. She was a dancer. No, I, you know, I just do a little blowfish venom, little, uh, Wait, little so ayahuasca. Are we, are we like Good morning, I, your I, I just wrote out like. All right, let, we need answer? your answers now. What, like, what, what was the answer? Like, what do you answer? Like, no, the, 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 the expiration give me a, date. Give me the exp exp expiration date. Expiration date. <laughs> okay, so the date expired. That's all I gotta do. Was, I wouldn't well. listen to her clue because it made no fucking sense. At I, all. I believe it. Um. <laughs> Proceeds to write nothing. <laughs> the date and month that this expired. 
Okay, I feel good. All right, foolish. Let's. We'll see your answer last. <laughs> Brandon, I'll look. give you one hint. The Simpsons have been running for over 30 years. The Simpsons show. <laughs> no, I wanted to see something. Jesus Christ. We I gotta see what he scribbled out. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm... He's writing a time. <laughs> time? I saw 1.15 on his paper. <laughs> 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 uh. <laughs> hey, yeah, these expired earlier today. Yeah, two hours what ago. What is that? Like January. Right. Ranboo, let's right. start with your answer. I'm going to say uh, May 2002. May of 2002. 20 years ago. Foolish. Um, oh, actually, no. Pun, sorry, excuse me. Uh, I went with August of 2005. August 2005. Foolish. Jake. Oh, wait, stop. Oh. Jack Manifold. I'm going May 2007, baby. 2007, the no problemo. Foolish, what do you think? January 17th. <laughs> sir. <laughs> did you write your answer in Morris code? Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, like, accidentally, like, I did, like, two colons. Like, no. it was supposed to be a colon. Foolish, we need a year. 37. <laughs> Foolish, we need a year, Foolish. Yeah. Okay, okay, um... <laughs> we need a year, Foolish. Not... 97. <laughs> 1997! Ladies and gentlemen, Foolish. Did you mean 1997 or did you mean 97? No, 1997 okay. to be clear. All right, Ranbu, you got it correct. Nice job. Wow. March 28th, 2003. Wow. Nice job. You were very close. Nice job. All right. Let's bring out that next oh, item. I, okay. Are oh, these meet uh, 25% of your daily needs? Yeah. It's 25% more than uh, that for me. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. I'm just didn't even make sense. <laughs> Man, well, you really messed up. <laughs> that marriage was a mess. It really was a mess. I don't it think was. you fulfilled her in any way, shape, or form. No, 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 no. I got a short tongue. <laughs> Really? Yeah, very tiny. Well, you can't do anything with it. Yeah, you couldn't even please me with that thing. No, I couldn't. Hello. He couldn't please a hobbit. <laughs> They're hair foots this season. <laughs> All right. Here we go. The next item. Take a look at this. This Don't is, this That's is Kate's mind. brand sauerkraut. Oh, yeah. Oh. It's called mild chow chow. <laughs> <laughs> It's perfect for beans, collard greens, potato salad, burgers, and hot dogs. Perfect for beans, huh? You put a little sauerkraut in your beans? Oh, yeah. I love to put a little mild chow chow right on my Chipotle burrito. Oh, boy. Oh, this yeah, look at that. Oh, it's rather discolored. Oh, look at that. Careful not to drop it, Will. Um, my... Is it normally that color? <laughs> that looks rancid. No! Okay. It's not normally that color. Sauerkraut. I don't even think they make this anymore. <laughs> My own chow chow. <laughs> okay. okay. Um, chow, somebody said chow chow's a dog. Well, it could be other things, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what do you think sauerkraut's made out of? <laughs> We're guessing the expiration What's the original yeah. color of it? Isn't sauerkraut, like, white, usually? I would hope not. Oh. Whitish color. <laughs> All right. <laughs> <coughs> All right. What do you think? The year? Is this another British product? Because I, the only in England do you advertise something's good for going with beans. A good only point. in England is someone like, oh, something good to go with my beans. <laughs> 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 Ooh, what a treat! Some beans! Oh, breakfast time for beans! What are you putting on the beans tonight, darling? <laughs> yeah, bruv. Yeah, bruv. All right. <laughs> Let's think long and hard about this one. I always do. Oi, brother, what's that on your beans? <laughs> now run me some of them beans! <laughs> Aren't you from Brooklyn? Yeah, I'm from Brooklyn, New York. It's an impression, baby. Home of the beans. <laughs> Home of the beans. The New York. Home of the big ones. <laughs> all right. Let's go with puns this time. Uh, all right. The writing on it, like the wrapper and stuff, looks pretty old. So I almost... 
July 1999. Oh, 1999. Jack Manifold, what do you think? I think it's old. I think it's real old. Oh, yeah. Needs, to, needs a lot of time to turn that sort of color, so I went for... Whatever the seventh month is in 83. Yeah. July 1983. Is that like July? Yes, July. July 1983. July 1983. Foolish. All right, before I answer, Austin, I just want you to keep in mind. Right. Whoa! All right. I thought I was about to see a nipple. He's trying to earn another 35 bucks. All right. <laughs> My God. <laughs> May 2005, but if that's wrong, then 2008. That's <laughs> <laughs> You've killed him. You've killed him. All right, we'll, we'll, we'll allow that it. That was a profuse right. kicking from production. Has killed there's him. no way that this expired in 2008. <laughs> you think this is... Okay, and Rambu, your answer. So I think, all right, here's, here's my thought process before everything. I think that was made in the late 90s. Okay. All right, and it's a bottled good, so those take longer to expire. So sure. I'm gonna say January 2004. January 2000. You think it would get that brown in like five years? Well, that no, thing has that's been when in it there expired. for 20 years at least. I guarantee that. Let me tell you that something. Is, let me tell you something, puns. Yes, Austin. You haven't gotten points in a long time. I haven't, you're And right. let me tell you, this round, it's different. You got points, you won 20 points! When did it expire, Damn Austin? It. it expired in the year 1995, April 20th, 1995. 19... Honestly, my guess wasn't even good, they just Let's take started. the tape off here, we yeah. go. Thank you, Caroline. Oh, April 1995 <laughs> is also when your daughter said her first words. You wanna know what she said? No, uh, Fuck yourself, no. Daddy. <laughs> Go fuck yourself, Daddy. She was three. She's gifted. She a full <laughs> sentence for her first she word. Rather poor parenting. Also, the first one was of that. I think I said light as my first word. A whole sentence. That kid's going places. Wow. Uh, Should be proud of this semen. Have you seen her in a while? No. <laughs> Oh, oh. God. What is she? <laughs> what is she, NASA, like 18 years old? My God. She's nine. Oh. That's not how time works. <laughs> All right. Here we go. This is our next item on Certified Fresh. Here we go. We've got some, ooh, delicious craft coleslaw dressing. Ooh, delicious. Oh, coleslaw my dressing. fucking Wait, God. Wait, that's coleslaw? Coleslaw dressing. It appears to no longer be a liquid. <laughs> okay. Oh, wait, that is disgusting. Wait, can you shake wait, it? That is terrible. Harder, harder. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. <laughs> harder, maybe? Faster. Maybe, like, can you go, like, more up and down? It's kind of like you're not... Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You getting it? Yeah. Yo, as soon as he jerk it off, I didn't look for a second. Guys, the original price of this item was 39 cents. Really? Okay. Oh, oh, oh. It's a clue. Oh. 39 cents was the original price of this item. It's like 1939. Whoa. <laughs> then why would, how is that? Let everybody guess independently. No, foolish, the, the, Let him guess. The hint is that it only cost 39 cents. So, probably. Don't, shh. Shh, not the year 1939. Uh, what inflation. Does that, inflation. Oh, so like things old. Okay. Shh, let him think. It's not in the sense of Twitter art. Let him think. What do I have to do to get three tries? <laughs> I mean, Austin. Austin. Maybe, maybe just a little. Is. Maybe just a little. No! Oh! All right, I'll let you guess a couple more times. That's what I like to hear. Wow, I felt oh something. Well. I'll get my dick out for five guesses. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not a problem for me. Maybe the production, but I'm down. Oh my god! The value of dick is plummeting. <laughs> I mean, I, I think thirty-five dollars is about five guesses oh my worth. God. <laughs> what an episode! Oh, foolish, I hope your eyes weren't open, because uh, mine sure won't. <laughs> they were. All right, you get a couple guesses. I have to honor her. I have to honor her, right? Um, okay. 18, 9. All right. Um, 
He's, he's really just a, actually just guessing. Three. I'm, I'm curious if he gets it. <laughs> Wait, what? <coughs> okay. Why have you guessed only three years apart? <laughs> I really very. You had three guesses and you guessed three years <laughs> apart? Okay, okay, I'm scratching one, you're right. Well, I don't know if I can finish the episode. <laughs> really? <laughs> What is yeah, that? All right. All right. All right. Okay. Let, hold on. Let's, sorry. Sorry. Okay. Let's go to Foolish Last. Jack Manifold, what do you think? When did this expire? It's 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 a solid brown substance that was once coleslaw. So I think it might be 89. 89. 89. We'll come back to you, Foolish. Okay. Ranbu? I said um, July 1975. July 1975. 1975. Wow. I went with uh, September of 85. Okay. September of 85. And foolish, you um, had three guesses. Can I like one more revision, maybe? Like, no. Okay. A deal is a deal. <laughs> okay, you're right. Three guesses. You're right. Okay. So uh, these are my three guesses. <laughs> All in July. We <laughs> didn't five years apart. Foolish. None of those are. Yeah. Look. Look at the ball. Look, <coughs> look at this thing. Look. Look at. Look down here. Look at the. Look at the podium. Question marks. Foolish, that's incorrect. I'm so sorry. I, this game's impossible. I you don't got know. three guesses. None of them were correct. Sorry, I'm not an expert on chow chow coleslaw, whatever that was. Jack Manifold? Incorrect. I'm sorry. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> that's embarrassing. Uh, I don't think I've scored. You were points. really close, <laughs> and you really need this amount of points. And I want to tell you something. Just like last round, where I told you that if you get this right, yeah. you're going to be more points on the board. It's not like last round, though. You got it incorrect. I'm sorry. Rambo, correct. Dude, you can't. Actual date. Solid block. 1971 June. June 1971 is when that expired. Oh. Yeah. That expired. Wait, what number is that? You did like That's two a numbers. seven. I said a seven. Wait, like you also did like eight. Listen, no, no. I just might not have brains, but he's got beauty. Yeah. Oh, yeah. does he? Ever... I'll give you 50. 50? I have raised my price. I, I don't like, think. In today's dollars, that's like a hundred. Oh my God! Hey, hey Jack would pull his pickle out for guesses. You don't have to pay <laughs> foolish. <laughs> Fifty dollars. We're gonna see. Very little shame. I wonder if he'd accept that, Will. <laughs> I wonder. Ladies and gentlemen, take a look at our scores. Rambo's in the lead with 339 points. Hans with 299. Foolish at 289. I'm feeling good. And Jack Manifold in last place. Still, you're not, you haven't passed I think I, I think I only earned points from the Joker, and that was it. I, I, I think I only got one. <laughs> but ladies and gentlemen, would, would you believe me when I told you it's still anybody's game on Name Your Price? When we come back, <laughs> we're going to see how this one plays out. All right. All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. To name your, your price. price. Oh yeah, look at our contestants. Don't they look good? Round of applause. Oh yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to play our next game. Let's wheel it on out here. Multiple choice is what my ex thought he had when he went to the body shop. Oh my God. Well, yes. For those of you who don't know, body shop, famous uh, strip club here in California. Oh, in Pocatello, Idaho? Oh yeah, that, that too. Yes. It's a chain. It's a chain. That's right. It's a chain right. strip club. It's I actually started. have a frequent visitor card. They do you punch really? it. Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. That's right. What do you get? You get a free dance on your chest? After tis your visit? fifth stamp, you get peed on. Oh. Yeah. Oh, my. Wow, I didn't have I, That's not the card that I got. Oh, well, yours is a little different. Okay. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, this game is called Chat the Bed. Sure. This is how it's going to work. We're going to ask everyone a question, and you're going to have to tell... It's almost as if nobody's moving my prompter. <laughs> Tell me which one of, our, your, of the four answers you think Champ will pick. Then we'll drop a poll. I really like that dramatic poll. Whoever pause, matches <laughs> with Chat will receive 30 points. All right? Ooh. So. Wait, should, hold on, Phil. Do we ask the question first? Are you confused by the run of your own show? <laughs> yes. <laughs> You well, even I understand. Oh, okay. The question. Here we go. Oh, I got it. Here we go. You run into a coworker in the bathroom and they don't wash their hands before leaving. You don't don't show your answers yet. Are oh. you gonna say A? Who cares? 
B, call them out to their face. C, tell all your other coworkers. Or D, don't wash yours either, then go for a handshake. Now remember, you're answering what you think chat will select. Oh. Uh, <laughs> don't chat. Don't type anything. Just smile. Smile, <laughs> chat. Smile. Gotta write down what you think the chat would say. Do you think chat would be vindictive? Foolish, what are you looking at? I'm, Give them a no, dirty I'm just trying to. <laughs> Do you think chat would say who cares? Um, okay, I bet I there's gotta, some people in chat who haven't washed their hands right I now. I gotta focus. I think even with the anonymity, anonymity. They're still, walking, they're still gonna not There's a sea creature themselves. in that right. bathroom? <laughs> yeah, they're still walking to sell themselves. All right, let's run the poll. Everybody's got their answers down. Let's run the poll. Don't change our poll. I didn't, I didn't put anything yet. Put it something down. I'm so confused. Put okay. something down, quick. Okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I was thinking it through. Bruce, you are amazing. You're the best content. <laughs> All right, leave it there. Leave it there, okay. everybody. Leave it there. Cover your answers. He's finding new ways to play every round. <laughs> Wait, did you guys not? Is it? Is the poll not working? Why are they doing? We're looking into it. What do you mean? This is a whole damn game. <laughs> Winner, non. What do you mean? We're looking into it. <laughs> we got a fifty million dollar stage here. How the hell did the poll won't work? <laughs> We're looking into it, folks. Don't you worry. Will. Yes. Do you know how I got this job? I banged Austin. I had sex with Austin. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Caroline, now they'll know I'm my secret. <laughs> that I have sex with women for money. Fifty dollars? <laughs> <laughs> He's driving up the price. Women? Oh. Women? Oh. That's Ooh. plural. Look, I'm That's true. plural! I'm single and have not cheated. I already offered you $50. Uh, Don't worry, okay. I'll find you after the show. Okay. Caroline, I'm sorry. I, I, I thought you knew. I'm gonna burn this whole goddamn Caroline, set no, down! Well, Caroline, no, no, come on. Oh. Off stage, off stage, off stage. My oh, God. that one went really well, didn't it, Austin? I'm really glad you did this. Bang my ex-wife for, <laughs> for bus fare. Then bring her on the show. No plan. Thanks so much. I, it wasn't good for me. I just want to let you know that. <laughs> yeah, you're gay. <laughs> I couldn't get an erection for three hours. <laughs> Went on for more than three hours. Yeah. You tried for she three made, she, hours. She wouldn't. She wouldn't give up until she is a persistent lady. We were on a flight to New York. You were in an airplane <laughs> bathroom. Oh my God. my God. Yes. Jesus. Did we get the pole working? <laughs> no, let's just talk about Austin's so, dick. No, it's some more. It, it turns it out. Work. Turns out. Show your answers. The pole didn't work. Oh. So we're gonna go to break and fix it, ladies and gentlemen. Wait, so we show our answers now? Show your answers and they don't mean a damn thing because oh. everything's broken. Okay. All right, you know what? Everybody gets 30 points. Yeah. Yeah. I got more points. Everybody gets 30 points, which means everybody's right Wait, where they we were. Can, we can fix this. We can fix this right now. Oh. Whoever's working the chat, just do a poll in chat. No. Do slash we're poll. Already, we're going to go to commercial because it takes too long. No, it doesn't. It takes a minute. No, I don't have mods. We've definitely been stalling for more than a minute I don't have any about mods. your dick. <laughs> any mods? We'll be right back with more yeah, Name Your Prize. Give me a phone. I'll do it. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to more Name Your Prize. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, before we get into our next segment, the last one was kind of a bust. It wasn't great. Will. Not our best stuff. <laughs> Will, I want to say something to you. Yeah. We have been so rude to you this show. <laughs> and we haven't paid you all season. That's true. That's we'd true. Like to, sleeping in a car. We'd like to change that. Ladies and gentlemen, we've got a check for Will Neff. Oh, my God. We've got a check for Will Neff, ladies and gentlemen. Give it up for him. Forty-two dollars and thirty-nine cents. Whoa, 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 whoa! That's a 
pretty big check you got there. In size and amount. <laughs> Congratulations, you might, co might cover the cost of one one hundredth of what you owe me. Oh! The child support? Is that what it is? For, oh, yeah, hey. For, for everything. For emotional Oh, my God, a wrestling! You son of a... Uh, all right, well, I don't know where Will went. Round of applause. Uh, this is what he does! I, I'm really starting to see the true yeah. him. Well, I guess you're going to have to help me with this final round. All right, well, here, stand over here, sweetheart. Over right here on this other side. All right, here we go. I think the music's going to get a little creepy in here because something... Because the ghost of Will Neff? No, <laughs> not at all. I don't think that's creepy enough. Give me your creepiest thing that you got in that motherfucking soundboard, Ferdinand. There we go. Ladies and gentlemen, as you can hear, that's the sound that gets played every time the haunted board comes out. Congratulations. Isn't this terrifying? I'm scared. Um, so spooky. So spooky. I shit my pants. As you can tell, it's thank you. <laughs> very haunted. Contestants, this is how it's gonna work. Behind each one of these numbers are points that you can win or you can lose. All you have to do is tell me whether each item I'm gonna show you costs more or less than this $10 aloe plant. Okay. If you're right, you will win the points behind the number. But if you're wrong, oh. you'll lose that many points. Oh, oh. shit. Oh. oh, goodness. That's the terrifying reality of the haunted board. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Who did that? That's weird. <laughs> This board has been terrifying, folks, for generations. Um, okay. Who's our last place contestant? I believe it's Jack Manifold. Absolutely. Jack Manifold, Ooh. I want you to come up here and point to a number. I'll point. I'll have to like point. <laughs> number seven. Number seven. Caroline, would you pull that off the board for me, please? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> 30 points. It's, uh... That's pretty good. Now, Jack, all you gotta do is tell me whether this variety box of chips costs more or less than this $10 aloe plant. 18 bags. If you get it correct. <laughs> That's 18 fun bags. Fun bags is, I don't know what the fuck that means. <laughs> that only makes the difference between a bag and a fun bag. Hopefully there's a toy inside. Uh, I'll show you a couple fun bags. <laughs> Take a big fucking puff of the cigarette for that one. Uh, you know what, I'm gonna go with, uh, I'm gonna go with less. You think this is less? I'm gonna go with less. 30 points. All right, Jack, get behind your podium. Uh-uh. Jack. Yo. Yep. You would be incorrect! Oh, fuck this game! I bit my cigarette! Give me a fucking new one! Oh! <laughs> this costs 11.99! Like is 70 more. cents a bag! More! You should have known. I mean, you just American, lost maybe. 30 points. That was kind of All right. Already, already already game in. Everybody's laughing at you. <laughs> <laughs> laugh at him more! Don't laugh! <laughs> You're so I don't dumb. know the US economy! What do we, we got a cost of living crisis over in. You know what? In Brooklyn? Know. In Brooklyn, New York. All right, here we go. Absolutely Foolish, crisis. it's up to you now. Yes. I want you to go. Rats or I want you to Stay there and pick a number this time. Oh, week. okay. Um. I mean, like, I can't tell you. Okay, that's fine. Um, number three. Good number three. Good answer. Round Thank you. Applause. Thank you. you Surprise you. Oh, okay. that's huge, Foolish. Yeah. Yeah. Now, Foolish, all you gotta do is tell me right now whether this baby food... More! ...is worth... <laughs> oh. You think more? Wait, can I handle the box first? Sure, catch. Okay. 
God, he's got great. I think it will be full. I don't think they're gonna. <laughs> How much is this empty cardboard box worth? Listen, babies are expensive. <coughs> I'm going with more. <laughs> oh, God. Babies are expensive. Babies are expensive. <laughs> Let me tell you something, foolish. Yeah. You're correct. 45 points! <laughs> You're dumb. You're dumb. Why You're dumb. We didn't even get the opportunity to guess. I was gonna guess the same oh, thing. Give me a fucking cigarette. and 69 cents. Easy. Foolish. You are still in second place. <laughs> Love to see that. Love Huns, to see that. Pick a number from the board. Now listen, if you want to choose a 10. <laughs> I mean, uh, it's not there. I'd go with number eight. Number eight. Sorry. Caroline, pull number eight from the <laughs> Oh! Should've went with 10. I should've went with 10. Oh. Wow. There's bad news all over this board for you, puns. All you gotta do for 15 points is tell me whether this Mr. Potato Head costs more or less than this $10 all right. aloe plant. Are we talking like retail or like on eBay type? Retail. We retail? bought this all at the same store. What a uh, I'm gonna go with less. Locking it in. Ooh. Less. Ran uh, did I call you Rambo? You did. Puns. <laughs> that happens. Puns, you're correct. 15 yeah. points. Oh. You must forgive him. We had a long morning. <laughs> we really did. <laughs> Five and a half hours, puns. <laughs> you said it was three. Well, I lied. Five and a half hours. Oh, God. Three was just to get it up. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> And then two hours after? <laughs> I mean, he wasn't. <laughs> I would assume if it takes three hours to get it up, it's gonna take a while to. You know, we, we don't need to get into the logistics of it, but. <laughs> you know, it's a, I'm, it's a position I'm familiar with. Anyway, let's. And, uh, I, and I still got more in me. <laughs> oh. <laughs> All right. Ranboo? All right. You were in first place, and you still are, actually. Sweet. <laughs> that works. Until you lose these points. But you gotta win points. You gotta keep winning, Ranboo. All right. Uh, I'm gonna choose. What number do you want? I'm gonna choose nine. Number nine. Caroline? Number nine, please. I'm sorry, I was looking at myself in the reflection. Oh. <laughs> number sorry, nine. Very much. Put some back into it. Not bad. But foolish, you better be thinking you really want him to get this wrong. Wait, it's my turn. No, foolish. <laughs> Jesus Christ! No, I was just gonna. All of a sudden, like, all of a sudden, you were like, "Foolish!" Like, get ready. I'm like, "What?" No, I was just saying, "Foolish." You want him to get this incorrect, because if it does, he'll take the lead and puns. You'll slip oh. into second place. Oof. Yes. So I potentially could be first right now. I've been told I should model this. Oh. Oh, the thigh toner. These there is a thigh toner. Oh no, she's not that I need it. <laughs> and, this uh, is a thigh toner. Does it cost more or less than this aloe plant? You gotta put it between your thighs. I know, but you gotta get the plastic off. <laughs> That's how you get the plastic oh. off, too. <laughs> Dangerously. Hello. Caroline, why don't you give that for a, take that for a spin? I feel like this could have a couple uses. Today. Yes, I'm pretty saying. <laughs> oh, God. Thigh toner right oh. here. Do you think this is <laughs> I, I believe it goes something like this. Oh, okay. Oh, oh okay. there you go. Caroline, it's more like this. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. Okay. Really toning those knees. <laughs> oh. All oh. right, fuck it. That's how we go for five hours. <laughs> I don't want to touch this. <laughs> um, we have some. We have some sanitizer. What do you think, Ranboo? Do you think it's more or less than this ten-dollar aloe plant? Hmm. Exercise equipment. You can't think. It's it's two answers. That's not going to do anything. I mean, I'm going to choose. Hmm. We need more wine, folks. Oh, it's working. I'm in your head. I'm in your head. You're not. You're not in my you're head. head. You're, you're not in my head. 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 I'm about to win. I'm about to win. Ah, okay, I'm going to say. I'm about to win. I'm about to win. 
God, it's so tense. June 16th, 1975. <laughs> you could cut the tension okay. with the thigh toner. I'm going to say more. More. Banboo for 25 points. You would be incorrect! Yeah! My God, five ninety nine. You know spent five dollars and ninety nine cents. That's incredible. That is. Which is that after it was value. used? <laughs> Even after it was used, it may be worth more. It's worth more now. More now. Yeah. <laughs> Let me tell you, that was five ninety nine, which means Ranbu, you have fallen into third, uh, tied for second place. And ladies and gentlemen, Ooh. ladies and gentlemen, Foolish has taken the lead. How? Folks. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no one saw it coming. <laughs> no one saw it coming. All right, Jack Manifold, Literally. we're going to give you... No. Absolutely not. <laughs> Jack Manifold, we're going to give you one more number to see if you can get into this game. I'll go with number six. Number six. It's a good number. Any particular reason? <laughs> or just like the number six. Ooh. 20 points. That's what I need. Right to first. <laughs> That's what you need, Jack. That's what I need. You know what, Jack? We're going to let you pick the next two numbers to try to get back in this game. But, but, you have to get both of them correct. You understand? Uh-oh. Okay? I understand. But then you can't choose another number for the rest of the game. Deal? I, I, I deal. <laughs> I didn't think I was able to choose a number for the rest of the game regardless, so. Either way. Jack Manifold. What the fuck is this? This is miracle grow. You pour it on, you, you yeah. pour it on your penis. <laughs> I'm kidding, don't. Do I get to take this one home? No. If I get it right. Don't do that, don't do it. Miracle grow, it's for grass. Ah. All right. Does it cost more or less than this $10 aloe plant? But first, pull a number. Uh, four. I thought that was your guess. Number four. <laughs> <laughs> four. Number four, Caroline. Poll number four. You want to go ahead and get that one? Oh, it's over here. <laughs> You're not even paying me. Oh! I, I still Whoa. think I'm over hundreds of points behind, but fuck it. We'll give it a go. No, because they could lose points. All right. Whoa. Jack Manifold. Oh, remember when I said you could pick the next two? I meant you could only pick one. <laughs> Sorry, Jack. I didn't do the math right. So this is your last number. Oh, that's fine. Jack, uh, miracle grow. More or less. More or less. It's a big fucking tub of miracle grow. You can grow a lot of grass with it's a that. The Costco size. Don't know what the fuck that is. <laughs> it's a it's a, a Sainsbury's Super Center. <laughs> oh fuck! If it's Sainsbury's, then it's definitely more. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Why did you say so? Definitely more. All right, from Sainsbury's. All right, Jack Manifold. That is correct, 50 yes! points! Yes! New York, baby! That is I correct. I don't think it actually, wait, can I go right? Wait, still, oh wait, fuck! It actually put me in the fucking, I'm no, in second place! No, that math is wrong. <laughs> no, it is not! Get no, back no. to your fucking stick! That math Get is there. wrong. This is absolutely <laughs> correct! Absolutely <laughs> correct! Oh, the math, second place. the math is correct, ladies and gentlemen! Yeah, yeah, New right. York! Wait, are you winning now? No, I'm in second. I'm sorry, the uh, math is correct, I'm being told. Good. Not gonna happen. That means in my ear, I'm being told. Correct math, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, we got a really tight game. A really tight game. Yeah. With Foolish Gamers in the lead with 364 points. Now, Foolish. Yes. All you have to do is get your answer correct and then hope that nobody else with more points gets their answer correct. Right, right. That's how you hold on to the game. Right. So, Foolish, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to leave you right there. All Ranboo, right. pull the number. Oh, OK. I'm um, going to choose two. Two. Banboo? That's huge, oh, Ranboo. That's huge. That is huge, Pog you. When, when <laughs> are you gonna bring out the object, you're guessing? Ranboo, if you get this correct, you go into first place. Ranboo, all yeah. you gotta do is tell me whether this Dove body wash is more or less 
in this $10 aloe plant. Can I, uh, can I see it? Sure. Sure. There you go. There you go. Now, folks, I'm not going to reveal whether you guys got it correct until the last moment. So each of you are going to be able to guess, and you're going to have to sit. Oh. 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 Excuse me. Use smell? How do you How do you use this thing? You like put it in your Here, hair. Here, don't worry. Let me do it. Yeah, hold on. I used an entire one of those on Austin last night. Oh my that god. That is body wash. What a dirty boy. <laughs> you guys taking a bath? We definitely wanted to be clean. Oh, oh there it is. <laughs> okay. Oh. Now, now what are you gonna do? I don't think we can show that. Oh, oh, my. <laughs> oh my god. Let's take a look. Uh, oh, this oh is. Oh my heavens. This, <laughs> what? this is not what I expected to. All right. If I know Rob oh, alive, then this is quite. The, can we get a napkin in here? Quite. <laughs> can we get a napkin in here? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I replaced the contents of uh, the lotion in that with. <laughs> you did? <laughs> She's Great. lying. She's lying. Jesus, Austin, how much? Why? <laughs> okay. Well, five and a half hours it does to a guy. <laughs> did I say five and a half hours? I meant three years. <laughs> that expired. I don't know how long ago. All right. Okay. Ranboo, <sighs> is it more or less than this $10 aloe plant? I'm gonna say less. Okay. Oh. We'll leave it at that. We'll leave it at that. Puns, pull a number. Think about it. Or tell us what number to pull. I'm going to go with five. Uh-oh. We'll do it together. Ooh. That's what we needed right there. That's what we needed. Oh, boy. Puns. Too bad you're going to lose. Yes. <coughs> Puns. All you gotta do is tell me whether this pumpkin spice cold brew is worth more or less than this $10 aloe plant. Is that Starbucks? Yes, it is. More. <laughs> wow. More? Yes. We're gonna put that right down here. The man knows his bucks. It does, he does. Foolish, pick a number. One less. Lock it in. What? Oh, without even seeing. I don't, I don't see? need to. He didn't want to see his item. Detective Pikachu on Blu-ray. Oh God. Ooh. Um, I didn't know it was gonna be Blu-ray. <laughs> Tell me this. In his defense, it is the '70s. Is this? This is gonna, gonna be worth a thousand dollars back here. Is this Detective Pikachu Blu-ray worth more or less than his ten-dollar auto print? You know what? I have to stick with my gut, going with less. Okay. Ooh. A Blu-ray in the Risky. 70s? <laughs> Again. Should no, I foolish. really just want to stress I did, like, should I where we that? are. Foolish. Yeah. If any of these boys got it correct, and you got it correct, Yeah. I think you'd still lose. Oh. <laughs> Wait, can I get a different number? No. OK. But if we get it wrong. So if they get both right. get it wrong and I get it right, do I win? Yes. Yes. OK. <laughs> OK. And if they both get it wrong and you get it wrong, you still win. Wait, can I change my answer to more? I didn't know I could actually, I thought it was. No, he definitely looked at Wait, chat. He thought that. it was in the back. <laughs> you got 40 points? 40 points? Yeah, I have 40. I got the 40. 35? I 35, yeah. I'm still I don't even very sticky. <laughs> I changed my answer one more time less. Okay, that's the same answer. Okay. <laughs> Folks, let me tell you something real quick. Let me pull this aside. Foolish, you better hope both of these boys got it wrong. I'm counting on you it. You got it right. Let's I don't even to, remember what they said. They let's go to Ranbu first. <laughs> so many times. Ranbu pulled off a number, and he got 35 points. And he said that this right here, this little body wash, was worth less than this plant right here. And Ranboo, I have to tell you, got some bad news. Makes sense. Ranboo, this body wash is worth more than this plant. Hey, you know what? You had a hell of a game. 
You can shake the Don't leader. touch me. Oh, wait, you're right. Do you want, do you actually, do you want to touch no, me? No, Sniff this. No, whoa, Sniff this. no, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Oh. Now, Foolish, yeah. you've still got a chance. Foolish gamers. Boy. You guessed right here that this was worth less than this $10 aloe plant. I did. Foolish? Yeah. You are incorrect. You are indeed now, foolish. It's not over yet, folks. Because puns, you would have to get this correct in order to win Name Your Prize. Wait, if he gets it wrong, do I win? Yes. Oh. God, I'm nervous. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, puns was very confident. Let me remind you the sequence of events that occurred. Puns chose number, number five. five. And he got 40 points. And we brought out this Starbucks cold brew and he said it was worth more than this $10 aloe plant. It was real cocky about it too. It is pumpkin spice. That's right. <laughs> and it's in season right now. It is. It's, hot, it's a hot commodity, cold commodity. Now puns, you get this, if you got this correct, you're gonna get 40 points, put you to 384, which is gonna be enough to beat every single person on this panel. That's what we need, Austin. That's what we're looking for right now. But if you're wrong, you're gonna pass that victory right over to Foolish. What place would I come in if I don't get a red? Do I get second? You win. would get third. Oh, that's win terrible. or lose, I'm the prize tonight, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Oh, no. All right. I can't wait to snatch it. Ladies and gentlemen, nah. puns <laughs> said that this cold brew was more than this $10 aloe plant. And let me tell you, he's correct! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, puns has won, name your Yo, prize. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, as my theme song starts to play, I got a check for you. Let's show it right here. Ladies and gentlemen, he's won a check of $43.69. What can I say? Awful. Wow, oh, ladies and gentlemen. What can I say? The rich just get richer. That's right. The rich just get ladies richer. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Puns. Round of applause. <laughs> ladies and gentlemen, stand behind that podium for me, Puns. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you for watching. Name your prize. I want to give it up to all our contestants. Starting with Ranbu, everybody. Round of applause. <laughs> First time on the show in studio. Ranbu, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> You can find him everywhere at Ranbu, right? Yeah, pretty much. Anything else you want to say, Ranbu? Any shout outs? Uh, I, my hand is still very wet. Okay, no worries, Ranbu. So we'll, is mine. We'll get it dry. <laughs> we'll dry it out for you, Ranbu, no worries. Ladies and gentlemen, our winner of Name Your Price, Puns, everybody. <laughs> Where can they find you, Puns? Um, puns on like everything except Twitter, it's Puns TW. Puns, everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, Foolish Gamers! Foolish, where can they find you? Uh, Foolish or Foolish Gamers, one of the, you know, just, you'll find it. Foolish Gamers, everybody, round of applause. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, last but not least, Jack Manifold! <laughs> Jack, where can they find you? You, you use the Google. Look me up on the Google. Jack Manifold. Hey, Look at the Google. You'll me. find it all. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for my lovely product presenter, Caroline. <laughs> Caroline, where can they find you? <laughs> you can find me at thatxwife.com. No, Caroline Kwan. <laughs> Caroline Kwan, everybody. Give it up for Caroline Kwan. And my wonderful co-host, Will Neff, everybody. He's not here. I don't know where he went. And I'm Austin Show. Coming up right after this is Hey Donna. Yeah! It's a fantastic show. And the special guest is right here. His name's Jack Manifold, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> He's going to be on an episode of Hey Donna, so be sure to stick around for that. Have a wonderful day. We'll see you on the next episode of Name Your Prize. And Austin, where can we find you besides... Oh. Yeah. Twitch.tv slash Austin Show, Twitter. Take care, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Let's raid, raid Twitch.tv slash Will Neff Mods, please.
Thank you, everybody. I'm the winner. I actually won. That joke, that joke was a little too oh. <laughs>